We are here at the Steve Harvey Boys Mentoring Program. We're here with the Redliners in the building, y'all. These are men that are standing up and being accountable for their community. Why don't you just tell people a little bit about the Redliners, man, and why y'all here today? Well, well, we was actually we here. Uh, Redliners was uh, established uh, back in '96. Uh, we're men of uh, integrity uh, of our different communities, and that's what we do. We give back to our different communities. Uh, uh, whether we feeding the homeless or whatever else. And today we're here because we are men and we care about our younger men growing up to be men. Absolutely. And that's why we're here to help them to uh, get all, get on the straight and narrow or whatever they need, an ear, to, an ear just to listen. That's what we're here for and to teach them how to be men in Ab their community. Absolutely. So tell the people how they can get in contact with your organization if they need um, you guys to come on out. Well, my organization, you have a number. Uh, I'm one of the founders of the Redliners, and my number is 773-593-2163. And we have a president of the of uh, my chapter, one of my chapters, uh, KG. KG. We have 11 chapters across. Uh, we have 11 chapters in 11 different states. That's so, beautiful. KG, give me your number. 773-671-2825. Absolutely, y'all. That's KG in the building. My man, Big Baby in the building. Of course. Bless you. Bless absolutely. You. Absolutely. This is your boy, Black Ice Man, and we here at the Steve Harvey Boys Mentoring Camp. Look at these black men in line. They standing up in their community right here. My brother, tell the people why you came out today, man. Can I get more information about um, mentoring? Um, I'm starting a mentorship myself. just want to get involved. I have a 17 year old son trying to make an impact on this world, trying to get him to make an impact on this world. Each one, teach one, serve, we can help, we can communicate, we can educate, and we can do some good things in the community. Absolutely. What's your name, bro? Marcus Culler. Marcus Culler in the building. This is Black Ice right here, y'all. We are going down the line, man. Look at these black men right here. They standing up in that community. Black men standing up, signing up to be mentors. Signing up. What's up, little man? Can we get a, you know, can we get a... That's what I'm talking about right there. We got young black men. We got soldiers here, y'all. We are all here for the Steve Harvey Boys Mentoring Camp, young man. Tell the people how important it is, man, to be here and be held accountable. Well, it's very important. It's very important to show these young men that there is a better way and that they, they, can, uh, they can achieve anything. It's about choices. It's about making the right choices. That's We're right. here with the Chicago Army ROTC Fire Battalion right here, y'all, in the building. Look at these young men right here. Look at these young men. Ain't no pants sagging down. Ain't nothing like that, y'all, going on up in here today. We're here being accountable for our community right here, y'all. We're here being accountable. Look at this line right here, y'all. We are on 66 and King Drive. You should be here with the brothers who are standing up in their community. What's up, black men? How y'all feeling, man? God bless. Good. Tell the people why you came out today man came out trying to be a mentor for our young black brothers that's out here today trying to be a helper put a helping hand out here absolutely there's only two reasons why we exist man to serve god and to serve man my brother talk to the people much needed helping hand man much needed absolutely we're losing too many generation of young people man and they say they say chicago is the murder capital they calling us chirac we got to do something in the building y'all look at this young man right here what's up young man we glad that you came out here we got sisters coming out here to support. There you go. That's what I'm talking about. Young black men in the community. We're at the Steve Harvey Boys Mentoring Camp. They still coming through the door. We got two young men over here too. Young men, you're here today. Tell the people why you're out here today. Why well, do you think it's a good cause? Absolutely. Uh, I come here on a regular basis. I work here. So, uh, it's a good cause. I support anything that's, uh, that's godly and uh, go for it. Absolutely. And who do we have here with you right here? Mark Vanders. Okay, all right. Look, man, we appreciate you guys coming out. We definitely need it. All the help that we can get to change the reality of our community right now, man. And like I said, we appreciate you for coming out. All right, thanks a lot. Absolutely. They're still coming through the door. Still coming through the door. Right there. Yes, 66 and King Drive. You all should be here. Brother Corey Brooks is in the building. That's right, that's right. We're here with the Steve Harvey Boys Mentoring Camp. They're still coming through the door. Appreciate all... There you go, being held accountable for our community. We're going to see if we can get Mr. Corey Brooks to say a few words. This is your boy Black Ice. We're live here at the Steve Harvey Boys Mentoring Camp. Standing up, my man Ziff in the building. 
What's up, baby? Great day. Great How night. you doing? Tell the people why you're here, man. Great night. Great day. Uh, the great uh, Corey Brooks, uh, the bishop, the pastor, who believes in that we can make a change. We can make a change right here and right now. That's right. So, uh, as a tribute to all of those who have came before us long throughout the history of this country, we're here to.